Right. I get a lot of, of questions on how to edit the game assembly to get alternative menu screen of the time. So I'm going to teach you how to do that. Now, in my comments here, I did mention you can use either a website or the program to do it. I'm going to use the programs so it's kind of easy. You don't have to download anything else. Uh, click on open file. Go to your game directory. For me, it's uh, C drive, program files, Steam, um, Steam app, common, me side, and then go here. Make sure you copy the part as well. Now go to the search for over here. You need to copy the following values here. Copy and then you paste it over here. Uh, uncheck the text and rational. Click on find next and you should see the following values are uh, uh, highlighted. Copy the following values and then you can either type 90, 90, 90 like this manually or maybe you could like right click on here insert the byte uh, yeah may maybe let's not do that because it's quite complicated after you're done with it click on save as and then go to your game directory again or maybe you can put it anywhere if you can remember but I'm going to put it uh, Okay, you know what, let's, let's put it in here, editor DRL, name it gameassembly.dll, click on save, then go to your place that you saved it, then copy it, go to your game directory, then right click, paste it in here, replace it. Uh, don't forget to keep your old one somewhere, but I'm going to use this one from now on. Just run the game again. Now, if you want to somehow restore your edit, uh, edited DLL into normal, you can reverse all the 90 into that value, but I guess you have to type that by your own. But yeah, either way, it works. So that's good. Let's skip the intro. I have mods installed, so it takes quite a while. There you go, as you can see. It's actually working now. There you go.